The program statement at the top of the slide is showing the creation of a float that's going to store 3.142. It is both acceptable and reasonable to think of this as being as follows, where you have a box into which you store the numeric value. However, this simplified model does not represent how variables are created in Python. As I have outlined in previous videos in this playlist, this is a name that in this case is bound to a float object with the value of 3.142. For Python, the following model is more appropriate. It is where we have a class, which is the float class, and we have an object that's based on that float class. And then we have an area with a reference that points to the object. We can also say that the variable has a name that's bound to the object where the object has the value of 